Pablo, this is a pack of hobos. Uh, last time we knocked out the water place and had our fun with the stupid piece of crap octopus. At least it wasn't as bad as the one whenever he had the mines. But now we're gonna knock out Dragon Forest. Because I honestly think this is probably one of the harder set of silver coin missions. Oh, of all times I could get a blue boost, I get it at one of the worst possible times when I really don't want it. Yeah, the red magnet, it lasts a lot longer than the green one. Which is, I guess, to be expected because it's, you know, the red one. Okay, I don't... Yeah, I know, that was really, really stupid, but as long as he doesn't get, like, way out of my sights, it shouldn't be that hard. What? I don't know what just happened. It's kind of weird. Okay. We got two more. I know where one is, and I still missed it. I don't know where the other one is. Where, where the other one is? I have no clue. Well, I better find out. I got one more lap. I'm gonna start getting creative. It's gotta be in plain slide, I just gotta be missing it. I mean, come on. There's no way. It's probably in that waterfall. It doesn't really matter if I win if I can't find the last one, so... Time to go searching! Yeah. We're going the wrong way, I know, TT. Trying to find something here. There's gonna be a lot of me doing this on the, uh... Adventure 2. Damn it, I didn't want to do... I... Well, fuck me sideways, it wasn't there. I guess we're gonna finish now. It's a good way to start off. In eighth place. Yep. Great way to start off. Um, yeah, we're gonna try again. Can't believe I missed that. That was just wow. Please don't tell me we're going to have as much trouble as we did last time. Ugh. And that's why you try to get as many as possible in the first and second lap. So the third lap you can spend catching up. Seriously? In the freaking waterfall? Like, the one in... One in Adventure 2 isn't that hard to find. I'm not saying that that one's hard to find or anything, it's just annoying. Look how far ahead those guys are because I've been screwing around and doing freaking barrel rolls. Oh, oh, that time I did a little flip. That's not gonna help me. I was trying to do a barrel roll again. They're not that hard to do, it's just I was being stupid. Because you gotta press. Shit. Shit. If I lose this, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna do it again, I guess. That would suck to have to watch me play this 
stupid level twice. Still getting closer to him. Oh yeah. They're within seeing distance. I don't know what to call it. They're visible. Yeah, that's what it is. Just been using weird words for simple things to say. That's usually how my speech goes. Oh, who's in the lead? TT. Figure that out. I love how Drumstick's the only character to not really have a voice. All he does is little clucking sounds. I don't win. It's bullshit. Come on. Go faster, you stupid piece of crap. Go, 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 go! Oh, fuck! Damn it. Damn it. Fucking bullshit. That's what that is. Bullshit. Okay, so far so good. Can't believe I have to do the. This is why we're doing this level now, so. I wanna do this later. Which you'll probably. I don't want to have to look at this level anytime soon. But yeah, we're doing a lot better this time around because generally, generally speaking, of course, whenever you play a level about three or four times, eventually you're going to get really good at it. You're going to know which zippers to go to and whatever. And that's probably why I got so good at this game because as a little kid, a little kid, you usually suck at a game. And you just keep on playing it over and over and over. And if you're devoted to winning, unlike my nephews, you're eventually going to get really, really good at it. But, no offense to my nephews, they're just having fun with the game. Because they're young and just starting out playing video games. Playing all the games I love. My N64 has become pretty timeless. Still works like a charm, too. Most of my games work on the first go. Like if I still had all the boxes, all my games, all my games would work on the first try. That's you usually. That's what I used to do. I used to have all my games. When I got a game, for I never actually bought my games because I was well too young. And as a little kid, you always get your games bought for you, which is really cool. But whenever I was little, and I'd get a game. My mom would make sure that I would keep the box. She made sure I kept the box because she told me if you keep the box, the games are going to be in good condition. And that's proven true. And then I started buying used games. I don't know where any of the silver points are here. I don't want this to have to be another one of those. Play it six times and figure everything out. I hate this one. Look how far behind I am. I hate how whenever you do that, you can't see Jack. Like, you just can't see anything. Oh yeah. Going up the ranks here. Shit. 
Well, there's three that I'm missing, and I know where two are. That's not a good sign. Using intuition, I don't know where one's at. But it seems like it won't matter because I'm only in fourth place right now. Working on third, which I am. So it must be, it's back there. Well, fuck me sideways. It doesn't look like I'm going to get first anyway. So I should just restart because that's just going to save a lot of time. Wow, I can't... I think I'm gonna title this the video of fail or something because it's really all I'm doing. It's just failing really bad. We're going to succeed. That's what we're gonna do. Like I'm go going to end this video on a good note. I just feel bad that there just has to be so much failure. I can't believe I can't remember where these stupid coins are. It. Gotta follow my own rules. Okay, there we go. Okay, tip numero uno. Don't hit the zipper when you go for that coin. We're gonna end this video on a good note. We're going to get first. We're going to get all the freaking coins. We're gonna run into Pipsy. We're gonna kick these. We're gonna kick ass. Maybe take an aim or two. to the magnet. I really didn't need it because I passed him. Now I know why this level, why this game was so hard whenever I was little. Whenever, okay, let me start over. Because that was all slurred. I swear I'm not drunk. I promise. <laughs> but anyway, this game was probably, this game, we're going to start over again. Whenever I was little, this game was probably so hard because I didn't know how the skid break thing worked. I never really power sl slid, slided, slid. English language is a bitch. But I never really did the power slide. And I never really, since I never really used the power slide, I never really used the, the breaking trick. The little, like, the really sharp turn. I never really did that. So that was probably why this game was a freaking bastard whenever I was little. And why it took me forever to learn how to beat. But anyway, we're going to cut it here. Because this level is probably also going to be a bitch. And I'm probably going to do it like two or three times. Uh, so this is Pack of Hobos. Like, subscribe, comment. Please. Goodbye.